Hi, welcome to another Windows tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to install Windows Server 2008. So to get started, place the Windows Server 2008 DVD into your computer's DVD drive and restart. When it's restarted, you'll see this Windows is loading file screen. And now wait whilst the top starts. Okay, now it's loaded. Choose a language to install. A time and currency format. For me, this would be United Kingdom. And the keyboard or input method is changed for you. So click next. Click install now. Okay, now choose the type of installation you want and the version of Windows Server 2008 you want. For this demonstration, I'm going to install Windows Server 2008 Enterprise full installation. Unfortunately, I will not cover the server core installation ever because I don't understand it. So let's carry on and click Next. Accept the license terms and click Next. Click Custom. Click on the drive you want to install Windows Server on and click Next. And now wait while Windows Server 2008 is installed. Okay, at this point, Windows setup needs to restart. So click restart now. Okay, now Windows has restarted, it will continue to finish the installation. Okay, now setup's finished, it will restart your computer one final time. It will be brought to the logon screen. Okay, this is a bit where everyone gets confused. This prompt isn't asking you to change your password, it's asking you to create a password. So click OK, enter a new password, and confirm it, and hit return. Once you see your password has been changed, click OK and wait for it to log you in. OK, that's it for this tutorial because this is as far as we go. In the next one, we'll be looking at preparing the server to have Active Directory installed. So look out for that and look out for more coming soon.